Welcome back everyone. You may be in a position where for some reason your Snapchat looks something like this and it just doesn't show you any camera, it doesn't show you anything. It may show you a black screen like this, maybe it just shows you a black screen that looks something like this, who knows. There's a couple different variations of it, but I've already made a video talking about some of these issues, but I'll go ahead and kind of update those specific you know, instructions. First of all, what I'll tell you is the number one thing you can do to make sure that your iPhone or Android or whatever the case is, that this specific thing isn't necessarily a software issue related to Snapchat is to make sure you have enabled the camera within the camera settings for your specific app. This is the most common reason this happens. The other things I'll get into in a second are like some of the least common ways. By doing this, you can pretty much assure yourself that you have tried the most common way and it's probably going to fix it. So what you want to do, you want to hop out of your Snapchat app or whatever the app you were just in and you want to make your way over to your settings app. So you want to click on settings, you'll probably come into a panel that looks like this. Now, if you're on an Android, it's essentially the same exact thing, okay? What you want to do is you want to scroll down until you find the Snapchat app. So if you're on an Android, you want to find the, your applications toggle, click on apps, and then find Snapchat that way. It's essentially the same thing. And once you go ahead and find that specific app, you want to click on it, and you'll come into a panel that looks like this. And again, Android is almost the same thing. You want to find either your you know, profile or privacy settings for that app or the things you've allowed for that app. In this case, it's already right here. So what we want to do is make sure this camera toggle is on and it's enabled like this. Same thing with Android. If it's this, look what happens. My Snapchat camera app will tell me this. I can go ahead and click out of it, but I will still get a black screen. It's not until I go ahead and enable it here does it actually go ahead and show me exactly what I want to see. So that's exactly how to fix it pretty much the first way. The second way and pretty much the least likely ways of fixing it if it's not your camera app not being you know actually enabled in the settings is pretty much making sure that your software is up to date I've had a lot of issues with Snapchat and it's always almost been fixed with an app update. So you want to go into your app software, whatever your app store is, you want to click search, you want to click up here, and you just want to type in Snapchat just like this. So click Snapchat, you'll come right into this panel, you want to click Snapchat right here, and you will pretty much be able to see your little app right there, and you want to make sure your app is updated to the most recent version of Snapchat out there. If it's on an extremely outdated version of Snapchat, you already know it's not going to work. So you want to make sure you're up to date and everything like that. And if you just updated your Snapchat and you go into it, you might be able to see that it's fully working now. As you can see, it was working in the beginning with two. But let's say you go ahead and do this and Snapchat still isn't working and it's still just showing you a black display. And just like how I showed you before, something like this. I can tell you right now, if your camera is faulty on your iPhone or Android or whatever, it's not going to work. So you want to make sure that the camera on your phone is fully working. On top of that, another thing that I've seen time and time again is people may be covering their cameras, either with their fingers or with their case. So if I go into Snapchat, you can see it's working. If I go ahead and cover up that lens, you can go ahead and see that it's gonna be black, it's not going to be anything. Now with my finger, it's different, but if it's with a case, it's gonna be pitch black. So it's going to be like you have an actual issue with your device. So you want to go ahead and make sure nothing's covering that camera. On top of that, it's probably best, like I mentioned, if you go ahead and update Snapchat, but also you want to make sure the camera's working, go into your stock camera app and see if it's also broken here. If it's showing you black stuff here, then you already know it's broken and it's faulty and you're going to go ahead and have to update your Snapchat or fix your phone camera in order to fix it. So that's really pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it means so much if you guys could hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my other channels. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.